Hi, this is Cecilia from Tarot by Cecilia, and today is Thursday, May 21st, 2020. The tarot card for today is the Five of Wands from the very popular Last Unicorn Tarot. And I gotta tell you, <laughs> I am not surprised to see this card today at all. What is going on, people? Everywhere I look, people are at odds with one another which is very much reflected in this card. All of that conflict, all of that tension. When did we as a society become so divided? Don't even answer that. I think we all know. And I gotta tell you, this is becoming the most prominent topic of conversation in my Facebook newsfeed. There are those who are appalled and there are those who are appalling. And it may be time to ask yourself, which are you? And how can you, as a human, with your fellow humans, mend some of this? Okay, there is just too much divisiveness that's going on. Everywhere you look, you see mean-spirited people with nasty comments. And, you know, you have to ask yourself, what is bringing all of this out? Were these people always this way? And somehow something has just brought this out of them and they're showing their true colors but this this is like a constant jabbing all right this is just the perfect card for what i'm seeing right now it's also very very sad that i'm seeing it so many here working to overcome personal struggles wouldn't it be easier to get along with one another and to help one another and lift one another up just saying. And at the root of all of this tension, which is really at a boiling point, like literally boiling over, there is a disinformation campaign. It doesn't matter where it started. It doesn't matter who's doing it. You know, this is not about conspiracy theories. But those who keep spreading conspiracy theories are definitely adding fuel to the fire. And I know I have already said this before, people, please, before you share things, please check your facts, okay? Make sure that what you are sharing is true. And ask yourself, this is probably one of the biggest questions, ask yourself if what you feel you believe about what you are sharing, uh, would you apply any consequences to yourself, to your loved ones? Mm you know the bottom line outcomes what would you want to see happen and what would you wish to prevent at all costs okay i don't see this conflict ending anytime soon unfortunately however i do feel that a call for unity will come at some point i'm just not seeing it yet in the meantime we are in the midst of some very big astrology Okay, part of this, even relating to this card, with the conflict and the struggles that are here today, is that we're right at the new moon, happening tomorrow at two degrees Gemini. Mm-hmm, all right. We're in, you know, the sun's in Gemini now. Mercury is currently in Gemini. And tomorrow's new moon kicks off a very long eclipse season. All right, that's why I said I don't see this tension going away anytime soon you know the eclipse season and the retrogrades are more than likely going to exacerbate the situation rather than help it if you follow my podcast or if you are a subscriber on patreon or members only you might want to have a look for my popular june love and finance tarot guidance due out at any moment it may very well be one of the biggest months of the year talk about massive change that's coming in. This is one you won't want to miss. And if you are not on Patreon or members only, you can find it through any podcast provider. And Podbean is my host. I want to thank you all very much for being here. I'll see you here again tomorrow. And as always, have a great day.